I started this dragon piece over a year ago, but I was undecided on how I wanted to do the base. I had a crystal cluster and finally decided to sculpt mountains that the crystals were growing out of. I used a two-part epoxy clay for this, and then I used liquid latex to mask off the dragon. The latex step was really tedious, but I got it done and then I let it sit overnight and dry. That way I could actually pick it up and touch it while I worked on the base. After conductive paint, it was ready for the plating bath. The base took three days of plating time, removing it at night so that I could monitor it during all of the plating hours. I got the effect I was looking for in the plating and then I moved on to the patina process with liver of sulfur. I used steel wool to highlight the mountain base and then I removed the liquid latex from the dragon. I did have to touch up patina on the dragon because some of the electroforming solution did make its way through the latex, but it did the job I really needed it to, which was preventing the dragon from plating more. I'm really happy with how this piece turned out and how my vision came to life with sculpting the mountains and having the crystals come out of them like a feature of the land. I had a lot of fun working on this piece and branching out into display art to change it up from making jewelry. What do you guys think? Do you want to see more dragon pieces like this? Let me know in the comments.